Just like to share this idea that uh, David Dunstan from the independent school sector and uh, I worked on for some time. It, basically, we tried to look at the idea of place value and try and work out why some kids have difficulties and others don't, or people have difficulties with different facets or characteristics of place value. So we based uh, the work on uh, some of the first steps materials where they talked about five characteristics of place value. And you'll notice in the top here, we've reduced that down to four characteristics and they're color coded. So there's an additive, which is a mauvey color. Uh, we've also got this sort of orangey red color, which is multiplicative. Uh, a light blue, which is the face value, place value and order. And the green section, which is about pattern and zero. And the idea of a place value planner is it works on a menu approach. And if you think about it, if we want to have a balanced diet, you'd have to have something from each one of those sections of place value. But there will be times when through your assessment you work out that some children are a bit weaker at one aspect of place value than another. So you might focus on a particular sort, for example, the multiplicative relationship. And so these planners that go from year one to year six are designed to help a little bit there. Uh, you'll notice, for example, if we take this one, the year four one, it's got a 4D for decimals and a 4W. So that means whole numbers. So in year four, you'd have to use whole numbers and you use decimals. And to support some of this, we've made some videos and we've produced this book called Playing With Place Value.